What's distressing right now for me is that so many years uh, uh, of of like civil society efforts and activism, etc., was spent on was spent on creating that hope, and that hope then translated into an outcome. But as you say, those outcomes are never static. What we must not lose is this idea that we are capable of being change agents. And yes, okay, things happen in a way that uh, w- was not expected. Perhaps um, uh, there is a justification that you know says this is validly done because the constitution doesn't prevent it. And Something has been allowed. Sure, it's, it's, not, that, it's not ab- illegal. Absolutely, and that may be so. And but but then you try and find other ways of expressing that that um, that uh, that hope. So um, and I th- I think this is especially true for younger Malaysians because I mean I mean uh, our generation. I think we're the same age or more or less. Uh, we've been through a lot. Um, um, one of my friends in civil society was saying, oh my gosh, I don't think I can do that many more years of whatever it is we were doing before, another another uh, birthday thingy or, or whatever it is. But then the answer to that is, well, it's not up to us anymore. It's really up to young Malaysians to now say, okay, this is the world we live in now. Um, where, to some extent, I think, the emphasis on, on leave aside the politics, emphasis on race uh, and religion is to an extent lessened, uh, in as much as it's made, it may have been ratcheted up politically in some ways. But um, that's important because you have younger Malaysians who have all been to the same primary schools, the same secondary schools, who speak the same bad English, um, who have the same problems in getting jobs, now stuck in the same boat wondering what they should be doing and what sort of life they want. And for these people now, watching all these changes happen and how it's being done is relevant information for them to decide their response and what kind of life they want. Um, and I think it's, it's not necessarily for the, for, for the worse. Short term, perhaps, it may impact on certain ideas or certain transformations, but we can still hold the government accountable as we did in 2018 at the ballot box. And that's still very much possible. There is still a, vi- vi- a vibrant opposition, even if you sp- if you pare it down. I mean, they've got what 90, 92 seats or something. That's a still a very, very healthy opposition presence. So I think you may have um, a, a very interesting dynamic evolving out of this that that we should try and be hopeful about, and we should not give up on this idea of trying to to hold governments to account. And you know, if you look at the current appointment of the the, the newest uh, Attorney General, uh, by all accounts. He's a, he's, a, he's a good man, um, federal court judge, very strong on rule of law, uh, objective, um, and doesn't seem to me to be the kind of person who will pander uh, to uh, expectations of a political nature. He will go by what the law is. And so there's, I think, yeah, it's half empty, half full, right? So yeah. I, I think there's plenty to, to look forward to in trying to address what we want to be. And, and I'll just say this, that for so many years, we were being told that if you are a Malaysian, you are this, that one product. But what we've seen happening in the last five to ten years is, you know, is an explosion of identity in many ways as different people come out with different ideas of who they are, what they are, uh, this homogeneity that, that works to advantage in some political quarters, not necessarily the kind of identity that, that many of us want uh, or, or even uh, embrace. Now, as time passes with, with improvements in media, in, in social media, in, in tech developments, etc., you can't put that genie back into the bottle. Now, what we become is ultimately up to us. And, uh, and if we're going to try and shape that, and, and, and push it along lines that are constructive or whatever, we have to find a new narrative, we have to find new language, we have to find new means of engagement, issues to engage over. Um, and all of these things, I think, give me, in as much as I'm depressed as the next person um, and frustrated at the fact that we're going to be facing yet another period of instability, um, uh, I think you have to take the positives from it and, and run with it as far as you can. Ta-da-da! Mouth, 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 mouth